Praise the Lord, praise the Lord. Poor Lord, it's the most misunderstood of fats. Did you know that lard is two thirds unsaturated? You know, butter is 50% saturated. And it also has oleic acid, which is the same thing that olive oil has that helps break down cholesterol. But the trick is that it has to be home rendered. The commercial stuff, like this, we will show a name, is poison. Well, not really, but it's very saturated because in order to get something hard, you have to saturate all the molecules so that they become solid. So home rendered lard is never gonna be solid like the other one. So it's so simple to make. Ever since I started touting, you know, the benefits of home rendered lard, that is my absolutely most requested recipe on my website. So it's very important to get fat that is unsalted. You're gonna have it in the freezer for a while because it's a little hard to chop if it's room temperature. And then just cut it in little cubes. And then you can either cook it in the oven at 300 degrees for like half an hour, or you can cook it on top of the stove so I can watch it and get the three stages of lard. One of them is the nice clear lard, the second is the intermediate, and the last one is asiento, which you use it to spread on tortillas and stuff. So you're just gonna cut it in little squares. And then we're gonna put it in the pan. It's gonna take about 15 to 20 minutes, depends. Okay, so be very, very careful here. It's better if somebody helps you. You're gonna pour off the fat very, very slowly. So this first stage is the very, very pure lard, very white and clear. I've made some ahead of time, and this is what it's going to look like. It's very white, very clear lard. Then we leave it in there, and it's gonna to continue to cook for a while. So then we get the second stage, which is the amarilla, which is a darker, richer, nuttier lard that's used in breads. And then we're gonna have the most wonderful chicharrones. These are homemade cracklings, and you can munch to your delight.